Hello. How's it going? Good. So sorry about that. I was thinking we were an hour behind for, I, I don't know. I guess I just had the time all wrong. Don't even worry about it. Don't worry about it. Um, we're going to introduce you and then we're going to get right into it. Okay. Sounds good. Today on the Matt and Ann show, we got Steffi and Craigie on the show. Hey. Um, we want to start off, what was the inspiration uh, for your TikTok channel? Well, actually, I had TikTok and I was just using it to watch videos. And I thought, I'll randomly upload this video of when I told Craig that I was pregnant with Olivia. Remember that? Mm-hmm. <laughs> You're on cross your Yes. Own. Okay. Um, and then I uploaded it and the next thing I knew it was blowing up. So we decided, my mom and I, to start posting videos to raise autism awareness. And here we are today. That's awesome. Um, I have a question, Ellen. What are your favorite top 10 movies? Favorite movies? Yeah. yeah. What are your favorite movies, Craig? Who Framed Roger Rabbit, The Muppet Movie, oh, Inside Out, How the Grinch Stole Christmas, the live action version, Madagascar. Awesome. That's awesome. He likes Disney movies a lot. We just got back from Disney, so. Oh, yeah. how long were you there for? Well, I was there with Olivia and my husband for 10 days, and they were there for almost three weeks? Yeah, three weeks. Almost three weeks. What's your favorite park in Disney? Magic Kingdom. That's a good one. And why? Why is it your favorite? Because I write Splash Mountain. Yeah, and that one's going to be changing now, isn't it? Yeah. What's it changing to? Tiana's Adventure Ride. And he's excited for that one, too. Mm -hmm. um, are uh, you guys sports fans? Well, he, Craig isn't really a big sports fan. I watch it with my husband sometimes, but we both like Iowa State because we were raised that way, and our younger brother went to Iowa State. Well, that's awesome. But that's about it. Do you have any favorite TV shows? Oh, what's your favorite TV show? The Loud House. That's his favorite of all time. That's a good one. That's a really good one. Uh, <clears throat> uh, what, what do you let me do on your free time? What do we do in our spare time? Yeah. yeah. What do you do in your spare time? Well, I play computer. What do you do on the computer? Watch YouTube videos. What do you watch on YouTube? What do you watch on YouTube? YTP collabs. What's that about? When YouTube videos collab in one movie. Mm, okay. Could we be? Could we be seeing you guys have a YouTube channel? That's the end goal, or one of our goals, but. It's just been trying to find the time has been a lot, especially with vacation and then the holidays. And yeah. I work full time and I have my daughter. So it's just like a lot. So, but we're trying to get there. So what do you do? I work for a bonding company. So it's just basically insurance. It's pretty boring stuff. <laughs> Is there anything that um, you would like to know about your thoughts, Craig? What we would like you to know about Craig? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Well, Craig is. Well, how would you? What would you say about yourself? I was being enthusiastic. You're enthusiastic. Yeah. Yep. He's very passionate about what he likes. Um, I knew you like Arby's. Yes. Um, <laughs> Craig loves Arby's. What's his favorite sandwich from Arby's? Beef and cheddar. Oh, yeah. That's his go-to. He used to get the onion rings until they discontinued them. I just heard yeah. about that, that they discontinued that. I don't know why they discontinued it. I know. Craig's not happy about that. 
What's your favorite place to go eating wise outside of Arby's? Um, Applebee's. <laughs> like Applebee's. Yeah. I used to work at Applebee's, so he used to eat there a lot. That's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> what's your favorite uh, uh, dog that you have or animal that you have? Um, our favorite animal? Mm -hmm. the, stuffed animal yeah. the stuffed animal collection he has. Oh, I'm sorry, yes. Uh, What's your favorite stuffed animal that you have? A red crown crane. Can you get it and show it for him? Hey. This is Roscoe. It's his favorite. He That's takes him with us on vacation. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he loves us animals. As you can see, this is part of his collection behind us. How many do you have? How many do you have? A lot. Yeah, too many to count. <laughs> do you have any other collections other than your stuffed animals? What else do you collect? Well, um, yowies. He likes to get yowies and the prizes inside those little chocolate guys. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> And he collects DVDs and books and... What's your okay. most prized DVD? Mm, which one's your favorite of all? The your... Muppets of Walt Disney World. Oh. That's a good one. Best of both worlds, Muppets and Disney. Yep. Do you have a favorite TV show? The favorite, his favorite TV show? Yeah. His is The Loud House for sure. Yeah. He, he can't get enough of that show. Um, we saw he went to uh, Disney World, obviously, just recently. And mm -hmm. I heard guy say he went to the one out mm -hmm. in Anaheim. Is there a favorite place he has to travel outside of those two places? Hmm. He really, we usually go to Disney a few times, or not a few times, every few years. So that's his favorite trip. But we like to take little small trips in between. Um, we went to the Mall of America a couple Yeah, of, was that's that? in Minnesota. Yeah. And he really liked that trip. Where else have we went? Oh, uh, the Omaha Zoo. Oh, yeah, the Omaha Zoo. Mm -hmm. And World of Fun. What to see at the zoo? Penguins. Yeah, he likes the penguins. We love that. Can you see yourself um, doing a TV show or reality show about your life? Uh, I, maybe, if that ever came up. Craig yeah. likes to pretend every day at the end of the day he does the credits for his day of the <laughs> Craig A. Vanderveer show. <laughs> and so he kind of has his own show, you could say. Yeah. Uh, I do. Me and Matt are really big fans of yours. We like your videos all the time. Oh, I love and, your videos. Uh, oh, that's so, so sweet. And uh, <laughs> I actually am curious, uh, what are your videos? Are you having a beer? I think you get one. I was getting curious. It was the one I think he uh, was drinking the beer at the bar. Oh. <laughs> or, or it was the hot chocolate and it had a little bit. Yeah. He didn't mind it. He knew what he was doing when he did it. And he like he didn't mind. It was like a teeny tiny bit. <laughs> um, do you have a favorite video that you guys have put up in the last year? Hmm, I really like the taste test one where we had all the drinks in the box and he sipped and tried them. Or the Arby's videos where he's jumping around his meat sweats. That always cracks me up. The meat sweats are probably my favorite thing in the whole entire world. He wears them everywhere, too. He loves those. They're so what's your What's your favorite video we've done for TikTok? The parks. At the Disney parks? You like yeah. making those ones? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What about yourself? Um, can you see yourself doing anything besides mm. TikTok? I mean, I know it's that you and your lawyer, but what about yourself? Oh, outside of TikTok for myself? Yeah. I don't know. I don't think I'm that interesting outside of my life with Craig. I made a TikTok for my little girl. 
Um, but it's nothing major. It's just little videos here and there. So, Craig, do you have a favorite Disney character? Craig, who's your favorite Disney character? Mickey Mouse. The classic. And do you have a favorite movie that uh, Mickey was in? The Mickey Mouse version of the Three Musketeers. That's a good one. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Uh, I can't say a favorite thing that you like to do. Ten things that you like to do. All right, let's go. Ten things you like to do. Okay. Exercise. Yeah, you like to ride your exercise bike. Yep. Having good meals. Yeah, he likes to go out and have good meals. He likes home cooking. Yeah. Take a walk at Disney parks. Yeah, you like to go to the Disney parks. What about your DVDs? You like to watch DVDs? Yeah, I like to watch DVDs. And play on the computer. Yeah, I'm playing the computer. What? Five more. Okay. Hear music on Alexa. Mm-hmm. You like to go thrift shops? Mm hmm Go to Dayhab Street. Oh, you love Dayhab. Mm-hmm. Um, hang out with me? Yep. <laughs> and what's, uh, one more thing. Spend the night at your house. You like to spend the night at my house? Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> what's your favorite type of music you like to listen to? Mm-hmm. Sesame Street. You like Sesame Street music? Mm-hmm. They're really good. If you had to have... And this is for both of you. You had to have one <laughs> meal for the rest of your life. What would it be? One meal? Sorry, I cut out. One meal for the rest of your life. What would it be? Okay. I'd probably have pizza. Probably just cheese pizza because that's just a safe bet. What about you? If you could only eat one thing the rest of your life, what would it be? Doritos. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Craig loves Doritos, nacho cheese. Yeah, nacho Another cheese. Fan. Has he had the uh, Taco Bell uh, taco with the Doritos on it? Uh, taco Bell. Mm, Dorito tacos. Yes, he likes the Doritos Locos tacos a lot. They're the best ones. They are really good. Oh, uh, what your favorite music? I'm sorry, what? What's, your favorite? What's his favorite type of music? Oh, type of music? Michael Jackson. <laughs> he likes oldie songs, like the older. He doesn't listen to new music, really. What Did you get to meet any of the characters down at Disney World? Uh, while yeah. yeah, who did you meet in Disney, the characters? Winnie the Pooh, Tigger, Piglet, Eeyore. You met the hippo from Madagascar. Mm -hmm. And the cat in the hat. Yep. Trying to think. Oh, Sideshow Bob from Simpsons. Yep. I think that is anybody else. And Krusty the Clown and Bart Simpson, and the Minions. You saw the Minions. Yep. And Patrick Star. He saw. Oh, and uh, hashtag Panda. And hashtag the Panda. Which um, Disney World do you like better, the one in uh, Anaheim or the one in Orlando? Orlando. Yeah. Orlando's just a little easier to get around. It's less stressful. What was your favorite ride? Favorite ride? Oh, yeah. What's your favorite Mickey ride? Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Oh, that's a good one. What was your favorite place to eat in uh, Disney World? Because we saw you hit like every great spot <laughs> down there. Oh, yeah. We save up so that we can go all out when we're on vacation. Sure. What's your, what was your favorite place or favorite food you ate in Disney? The Liberty Tree Tavern having a turkey dinner. Yeah, that one's really good. They serve, it's basically like you have a big Thanksgiving feast for your meal. That is awesome. Yeah. It was good. If you go with any character, who would you work with and why? Hmm. Probably Mickey Mouse? Yeah. And Donald Duck. Donald Duck. And Goofy, too. <laughs> All of them. <laughs> yep. um, <laughs> what is your favorite Pixar movie? Uh, the Toy Story. Which one? Do you like them all, or do you have a particular one you like? I like them all, the Pixar films. 
Which one's best? One, two, or three? I don't know how many there are. One, a four. There are four, four films. Okay, which one's the best out of the four? Toy Story. The first one? Yep. He likes a good original. The original is classic. Uh, two is like yeah. a good second, though. Two is pretty good, but. Oh, I, uh, I like number two also. Hmm. I think we could. I think that would actually be good if we would talk about things Craig was interested in. I could see him going on and on about it. He has a lot of knowledge of like Disney movies and all that stuff that a lot of people don't know. So he could probably elaborate on that. When did his uh, Disney interest start hitting? Like, was it when he was really young? Yeah, I feel like we've always watched Disney a lot growing up. Um, so he's just always been kind of into it. But I don't know when it really got. When you when he started watching YouTube a lot, he got really into it because he could learn about the voiceovers and when things came out and the backstories. So he likes that kind of stuff. Uh, my next because he has a great voice i feel like yeah. he could be a great voiceover actor. yeah he's everybody says that he is a good voice for being a voiceover or something like that if he did a commercial i feel like it'd have to be for arby's because <laughs> he is a big arby's representative we have to get that done to get him to uh, be an arby's representative do you eat coffee or any coffee? Um, he doesn't like coffee, but what kind of pops do you like? Soda. Yeah, what flavors? Diet ones. Yeah, he likes Coke Zero a lot. Yeah. What is your least favorite food? Mm. <laughs> What's your least favorite? Spaghetti. <laughs> 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 You knew that was coming. Why do you not like spaghetti so much? It's because it looks like worms. <laughs> they look like worms all slimy and stuff. Well, I think it leads back to when our little old brother was young and he ate spaghetti and he got it all over his face. What? I didn't. No, Bennett did. And it makes me hurly. <laughs> <laughs> That's absolutely awesome. Your face do, do you cook at all? Do we cook? Yeah. yeah. Um, Craig's good at cooking. He likes to cook things from the box typically just because it's easier for him. But he likes to cook that stuff. Favorite thing to cook? Well, we, together we make stuff. We make like dirt cups, um, Rice crispy treats, which you might make those today. What else do we make? Uh, cheese dip. Yeah, we like to make cheese dip. He likes that with the crock pot. Uh, what would be your favorite uh, moment in your, uh, I get your career? And, you know, in so many great videos that you have, what, what would you say would stand out even more? For example, um, you know, we have so many favorite videos. Mine's the Kmart video. <laughs> the Kmart with him? Oh, I love it. I think Craig's going to have to go out for a little bit because he's... But also, I can stay. Okay, you want to go out there? Yeah, I'm done with this. Okay, so we'll see you in a little bit, okay? Shut the door behind you. <laughs> Uh, what would be your favorite, um, your favorite video that you've done that really, um, is stand out to you? Uh, my favorite video that we've done? That stands out to you. What oh, you? stands out. Okay, sorry. Um, favorite video that stands out that we've done? Um... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's so hard to think on the spot about that. I love most of them. I mean, we have a lot of fun. I like the one we just did with Roscoe. 
um, <laughs> oh, yeah. Roscoe it's found his little... sock because that was really fun to make. Uh, you do you have on a random occasion or do you have some that are like planned out that you're gonna do? Yeah, a lot of ours are planned out because we don't actually live together. So when we are together, we kind of have to have a set plan. Um, but Craig usually doesn't know the plan going in. I just kind of have an idea of what I'm going to do and then see what happens. Um, but then a lot of the Florida ones were kind of on the whim since I was with him the whole time. Like the Roscoe one, that was just how we, when we used to live together, that's how it was. Awesome. I'm sorry, what? What motivates you to make oh, new videos? Oh, okay. Great. Motivates me to make new videos? Well, I watch a lot of TikTok and get a lot of ideas from like other people that make TikToks, like Baker Banner, um, The Man. I watch. <laughs> I watch your guys' YouTube with Baker, with Baker Banner. Banner too. Yeah, I watch a lot of TikToks and then I kind of get mo inspiration from them and I'm like, oh, I could do that with Craig or I should try that with him. So, do you ever think that you would go outside and buy and do something to do it by yourself? By myself? Yeah. Maybe. I thought about it. Like, I'm not that interesting. But I have things I could do, like um, like being a sibling with someone with autism yeah. or like parenting because i a new mom. Well, I've been a mom for a year, but I have a lot yeah. of things with that. Well, um, um, thank you. I mean, you do with your baby, baby. Yeah, I made a TikTok for her. Uh -huh. Um. And I make some videos, but I don't know. I feel like with Craig's TikTok and working and being a mom, trying to find the time gets a little difficult sometimes. Absolutely. So, uh, when you guys go out for a neighbor, when you go to Arby, do you get recognized at all? Um, well, Craig got recognized quite a bit in Florida, actually at the park so we were surprised how many people came up to us and knew who Craig was and we've been recognized in Des Moines a few times. Yeah, do, do you enjoy uh, being recognized? I think he does. It kind of depends on his mood that day. Um, he's If he's in a good mood he'll be really good with it and excited but if he's had like something come up that threw him off his day sometimes he might not be as friendly uh -huh. just because in his head he's still trying to cope with what happened that day yeah. uh -huh. have you guys always lived in iowa or did you have another place you lived in before iowa no we've always lived in iowa that's awesome uh, i mean we live in Philadelphia. and i lived in los angeles for a little bit though. Oh, nice uh, uh, do you, um, how old is Craig? How old who's is older? Craig? Yeah, who's older and um, how old are each of you? I'm the oldest, so I'm 30. Okay. And then Craig is 28 and our littlest brother is 23. Uh, <laughs> I should probably know that, but I don't know. <laughs> do, do you ever think about your little brother being in the videos he's been in a couple of them uh he's doesn't he lives in a different town than me and craig okay. so when we're together he'll be in them sometimes like he was in one of our taste test videos uh -huh. i can't remember which one for sure but I remember using that, but. And we're going to have quick fire questions for you. Basically the same we asked Craig, but we're going to ask you. Um, okay. What's your favorite movie? My favorite movie. Well, it's Christmas season, so I feel like Elf's on my mind. That's his <laughs> favorite movie, too. I love Elf. What's your favorite TV show? 
Oh, don't judge me. I like The Bachelorette and The Bachelor. <laughs> I like reality TV. Okay. And, and why is it? What makes I it not your favorite show? I don't know. I just think it's entertaining. Um, it's kind of like you're watching. I don't know. It doesn't. It can't be real. I mean, I know a lot of it's not real, but oh, well, we tried. It's just like a train wreck. Career. You know, you have to watch it. Yeah. Uh, if, you, if, if you were to marry, could you see yourself being on the path? I don't know, because I think that'd be hard to do with like your family watching. <laughs> That'd be hard. And I don't know if I could date that many guys at once. I feel like I'd have to be on The Bachelor and just be like competing. I don't think I could have all those guys. Absolutely. Uh, Too which, much work. <laughs> what's your favorite food? Oh, I like pizza, um, tacos, pasta. Uh, what's your favorite food to cook? To cook? Oh, uh, I'm not the best cook. <laughs> I don't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like to make spaghetti a lot. It's pretty <laughs> easy. If you had, I know you guys said you ain't huge sports fans, but if you have to choose one team to root for uh, professionally, who is it? I better say the Cowboys because my husband's a big Cowboys fan. <laughs> Sorry. I'm a big Cowboys fan. He's a You're Cowboys. a Cowboys fan? Yes. He's a Cowboys fan. I'm an Eagles fan. <laughs> I got a right now. Um, oh, yeah. I'm sure my uh, husband's watching him at home. You say you were married. How long have you been married? Uh, we've been married for four years. And when did you meet your husband? I met him in 2011. I met him right after I turned 21. Uh, I, uh, what is your favorite restaurant? Mm, well, in Des Moines, we have a restaurant called Bordenaro's, and it's like a pizza place where they make the pizza there. It's not a chain or anything, and they have really good thin pizza. So I'd probably say them. Okay. Uh, if it was a chain, I'd say Olive Garden. <laughs> Olive Garden's amazing. I like the breadsticks. <laughs> what is your favorite place to go to? My favorite place to go... I like going to the zoo too, and I like taking my daughter. Um, Do you have a favorite animal eat. at the zoo? My favorite animal? Okay, I like the goats and the llamas because I like <laughs> that you get to feed them. <laughs> I know you can see them anywhere, but I enjoy yeah. feeding them. Um, I know Craig hates spaghetti. Do you have a food that you hate as much as Craig hates spaghetti? <laughs> I don't know if I hate anything as much as Craig hates spaghetti. <laughs> um, I don't like fish. That's the same I can eat thing. like some fish, but I don't really like it. He was eating fish right before you guys got off, <laughs> and I'm like, I can't eat it. I had to get away from him because he was eating it. Uh, you you the only had three albums to listen to your whole life. What would that be? Oh gosh. Um I can only listen to my whole life. It'd probably be three Taylor Swift albums. <laughs> Did you listen? I want like a variety, like you know, her first album, um, uh, one in the middle, and then like her new album Evermore. You know, so I have a little bit of variety there. I me and him used to be the biggest Taylor Swift fans back in the day. I still love her. Have you ever got to see her in concert? I haven't. She came to Des Moines once, but the tickets were, like, astronomical how much they cost. And that was, like, to be in the nosebleeds. And I just couldn't do it. Where, where do you see yourself in five years? In five years? Um, I'll still be doing stuff with Craig. Um, hopefully I have another kid or two. But I'll probably still be at the same place, you know. I'm pretty happy with my life, how it is right now. 
Um, my last question for you is you could live anywhere in the world. Where would it be? Oh, man. I don't know. I'd have to be able to take, like, all my friends and family with if I moved anywhere else. Yeah. But maybe, like, Hawaii or something, you know, nice and warm and tropical. You were in a while. Were you really good with you? Did you say you had it for your own family with you? So, for example, um, how many people really you for you with you? To Hawaii. Hawaii. Like, what would be the necessary people to bring? Obviously, your family, but how many of your friends would you bring and all that? If I moved? Yeah, if you moved. Like, you have the unlimited amount of money to bring whoever you want. <laughs> oh, gosh. Um, well, I'd bring my family and, like, my mom and dad and brothers and uh, my brother's fiance. And then I'd have to bring Dusty, my husband's family, too. And then I'd probably bring out, I don't know, like, six friends, maybe. That's not bad at all. Yeah, I don't need a huge group, but I need my core friends to come with. Uh, I, I have uh, two more questions. So you say your husband is a cowboy fan. Uh huh. Do you know what his favorite player is? Um, is Dak Prescott the quarterback that's yeah. injured right now? <laughs> I know he liked Dak. Um, he really liked Tony, even though, you know, he wasn't the best. <laughs> I like Andy Dalton. I used to be a Bengals fan because, well, I liked them because I liked their helmets. Yeah. So that, I'm a very dedicated fan. But I liked Andy Dalton, and now he's the backup. Well, now he's the quarterback for the Cowboys, so I, I don't mind that. Was he from Dallas? Is that how he became a fan, or – no, Iowa doesn't have a professional football team, so I feel like it's kind of you're either in Iowa, well, everybody's a different fan, yeah. but a lot of people are Packers, Vikings, and then there's a lot of Cowboys fans. I don't know why that is, but. And that is interesting. Uh, my last question is, uh, if, if you had your own TV show, what would, what would it be about? Oh, my TV show would probably be about life and what it's like um, growing up with a sibling with autism and kind of navigating through life with that and the hard times too, because it's not all sunshine and rainbows. There's times where it gets hard, but it's also very comedic. <laughs> yeah, it, 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 I have a written day as well. Um, I have CC. Uh, if you could tell anybody in the whole world, what would, what would be your message for people like myself and Corey uh, uh, yeah. that have disabilities? Yeah, and, mm -hmm. uh, what would be your message? From being around Craig all these years. Yeah. I would just say to be kind. I feel like there's so much hate in the world. And I mean, I still deal with it on TikTok and it's a little discouraging sometimes, but you don't need to say mean, mean things. Like be kind to everyone and people with disabilities are just like us. So just treat them like a normal human being. Absolutely. I, I, I'm really happy that you said that. And to me, you know, we get that a lot. So mm -hmm. you know, that's fun, but you really, my brother. Um, no doubt. Uh, you know, I, I'll be your anger again. That'll be great. It was great to have you on our show. It was an absolute honor. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, thanks for having us. Thank you so much. It was really fun chatting with you. And um, that was today's show. Thank you so much for coming on. And you want to promote anything? Um, go follow Steffi and Craigie on TikTok and Instagram. Everybody go follow <laughs> them on TikTok and Instagram. <laughs>
Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye.